Yes, go to the Eton booth. They always have cool uh, emergency gear. Let's check it out. This portion here? Yes, this portion oh, lights up. Oh, okay, yeah. So, it's, yeah, it's obviously not illuminated right now, so it's just kind of clear. So it'll light up so that you know immediately just by looking over without reading the screen what level of alert you need to know is going on. Because a red level means, like, get in the basement, in the bathtub, you know, take immediate action in terms of getting out of harm's way. And this one retails for $39.99. That's oh, not bad. Yeah. And I was also looking at your uh, hand crank yes, items. Can you tell me something about these? Yeah. I love this because you, you never have to worry about batteries. That's exactly, great. right? That's the best thing. And then next you've got the FRX2 and the FRX2 radios. These ones retail for $39.99. And what they add on, it's like an add-on from one to two to three. They add on the solar panel, so you can just kind of sit this out in the sun or in your windowsill and it will charge the rechargeable battery inside. You also have the crank power. And then the other thing this adds on is the USB out to keep your smartphone charged. So when your smartphone is dead, like those folks who suffered through Sandy for like 14 days without power, this can help you charge your cell phone as well. So you can get word out to your friends and family that you're okay, or you can also call for help if you need it. Did you did you say the price point on this? Yes, this one is $39.99. Oh, wow. That's great. And then you move up to the FRX3. Now this one retails for $59.99. It adds on an additional power source. So this has four power sources. You've got the crank power, you have your solar panel power, and then in the back, I'll show you on the red one, it's probably better for your filming. In the back, you've got the NICAD, the internal NICAD batteries, and also you can throw in AAA batteries to make sure you stay charged for all of your emergencies. This one again has the USB out, so you can keep your phone charged. It also has the, the micro, micro in, and it has auxiliary in, and also uh, you can listen to your headphones through there if you want to listen to radio without bothering everyone. This one is a digital radio, the other two are analog radios, and this also has an alert function. So when you select the weather band that, that comes in for your area, if you push the alert button, then the radio will automatically turn on when a weather alert comes in for your area to kind of let you know that there's an impending storm. This flashlight also has additional functions. It has a regular flashlight, and then it has the flashing red emergency beacon. So you've got multiple options there as well. I like that. How long, um, I don't know if you know, but how long does it take to charge with the sun? You know, I don't know exactly how long it takes to charge with the sun. I, mean, I guess it depends on how bright the sun it, is. Yeah, there's a lot of dependent factors. But at least you have that option. Yes, That's exactly. Rare. So it gives you a lot of options to kind of stay informed, aware, and be able to communicate outside with other people, which is most important, you know, during these emergencies. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thanks for visiting.